what's up guys welcome to the channel you guys like i told you guys in my previous video that we are going to be dissecting and gisting having a conversation and catching up on the bb ninja season 9 on this particular channel i wasn't joking when i said that you guys welcome back to the channel my name is vicky for those of you who are seeing me for the very first time guys if you're interested in bb ninja season 9 this is the channel to be on and this is the best time for you to subscribe if you're not subscribed to the channel turn on your bell notification and please 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 like the video any video you see me just in about bb ninja just know that i'm bringing in the vibe and please do not forget to leave your comments let us just in this comment section let us talk in, talk uh, talk about this dope housemates that biggie brought for us in total number biggie brought 26 in total of the number of housemates he brought into the house for this particular season and you guys you know that learning 26 name individual name and their team name is not something we are going to do right away but yeah i have my note here which i was writing while they were coming in because i'm ready for the gist i'm here to tell you guys the names of the housemates and a little i actually observed while they were coming in so you guys just sit down relax chill because a lot of different personalities came into the house and in the order of how they came in the first set that actually came in was named uh, Zimwe. They are a boyfriend and girlfriend and a, they are a couple you know and they are five months in a relationship. The guy's name is Zion and the girl's name is Chimwe. You understand? This couple just met early this year and they became a thing. They decided that okay they want to come and show us how they will be growing in the relationship or they want to come and make other housemates help them start out their relationship that one is their business but they came in as a couple with the name Zimwe as their team name and then the second people to come in are two guys who claimed to be virgin one is a 24 year old and the other is a 29 year old you get and their name is Mickey and Femi David you guys these guys came in with some type of vibe in fact immediately they called them in they pulled their chest their shirts they started rolling on the stage like they were already giving us a show for our money so let's look out for them and they are wondering that they are proud and they're telling us that it is not easy to be a virgin for 24 years and 29 years as the case may be and these boys will be we would like to be referred to as radicals that's their team name and then the third group of people that came in they said to come they said they are coming to scatter ships while keeping their relationships intact they give us the vibe of a tomboy and a girly girl i don't want to mention what they are because people are already speculating on social media that they are this they are that and one of them's name is dj Flo and ruthie and they have a team name of flourish so what they're trying to tell us is that they are coming to scatter other people's relationship why their own relationship they'll keep it intact and we are wondering what relationship do you people have a tomboy and a girly a, a girly girl you get that kind of a thing anyway guys the fourth pair is a niece and her auntie and guess what guys what's really spe uh, spectacular about this particular niece and auntie duo is the fact that the auntie was the one that brought the niece into that put the idea of the baby ninja thing into the head of the niece that like she was the one that said come on girl let's go for this particular show and their name is chini and ne and their 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 team name is nine or something like that you get these people came out with the vibe of that Igbo local you know i'm not you know, not local or tribal kind of situation that's how they came in and the niece is super tall like they are very very tall and then the fifth duo that actually came into the house is Tofa and Suj I don't know if I'm pronouncing that name well but with time you're definitely going to be studying or learning how they pronounce their name correctly you get and the name of their and their duo name is Asis I don't understand Asis you know they are like fire and ice something like that you understand so they said their pair name is Asis and then the six set of people that came is Victoria and Sean you guys on Twitter is already they're already saying oh Victoria is gonna win the show you do not care about the guy she came in these people are said to be best friends and they've been best friends for like yes they met in dubai and all that and they are just friends this is a a duo of a guy and a girl and they have been friends for a very long time their stage name is chatoria that's the name they would like to be known as as a duo chatoria and then the seventh people that came in was an identical twins ladies like these ladies came in with vibe like the energy of oh, the energy is so over the roof kind of situation you understand you see them you know and people will definitely be mistaking them. both of them are djs like surprisingly or interestingly the both of them are djs and they are one and handy 
I don't understand. Wani and Handy. So their stage name is Wani X Handy or something like that. So they are still bearing their individual names. Anyway, guys, the eighth duo that came in, this duo met on Twitter streets, and one is even married. You know, the one that is by name it, TJ is married. Ben, you understand? So their stage name they would like to be called Better. <laughs> it's becoming really interesting because this whole this whole duo that came in, they have some spectacular thing to every duo that came that, that came into the house tonight. Every duo seemed to be unique in their own way. And of course, they're supposed to be unique in their own way. Anyways, the night people, the night duo that came into the house are another identical twins. OZ and OC, you get. And these boys are the Mbadiwe twins. Like they are this popular old money politician in Ozumban I don't know if you guys know of that popular politician. There's somewhere like in Lagos here, like that is Ozumban or something like that. These are the people we are talking about. They are Lagos socialites, you understand? They are the kind of reincarnation or another thing, another kid wire. They are another set of kid wire coming into the house. Maybe basically not because of the money, I don't know. But I'm sure maybe they are coming because of the fame because these boys are from a very wealthy family. And then the tenth set of people that came in are. So you'll see and Damilola, they are friends and they decided to come into the show to actually give us a show indeed. The eleventh set of people that came in is a beauty pageant and a pole dancer, Anita and Nelly. Their stage name is Nelita. They actually met in a pageant in 2015 and they've been friends from that time up till this point. Then the twelfth, the twelfth set of people that came in, their stage name is known as Tease. <laughs> <laughs> Mayo and Toby is their name. They said they are coming to give us teas and reese. So we are just going to watch out for this particular set of people. It's not by telling us on stage that you're going to bring teas, you're going to bring drama, you're going to bring this, you're going to bring fire, you're going to act it out. We want to see it. We did not come here to play. We want the drama. We want something interesting. At least to distract us from the drama that is happening in the country at the moment. Okay. <laughs> and then the second to the last set of people that actually came into the house today are a married couple. You guys, they dated for 10 years and decided to get married on February this year. And their honeymoon that they are supposed to be you know, nurturing their, their marriage, they came, they are coming into the house. This is a married couple, a man and a woman who are married. To us, they are married. To the world, they are married. They are telling us that they are married. But their strategy, one of their strategy is telling the housemates that they are best friends, not letting them know that they are married. So I don't know how that is going to play out or I don't know how that is going to help their game. But that's what they are actually talking about, that they are going to tell the housemates that they are not married. But we out here, we know that they are married. And their names are Kesia and Kenny Ray, and they'll be known as the duo will be known as Double K or something like that. Yeah, Double K. That is their you know tag names, Double K, Kesia and Kenny Ray. The last but not the least housemates that actually housemates that actually walked into the house today are sisters. Whatever you want, they said they will give it to you. Whether you want fire, whether you want ice, whether you want war, whether you want fight, you want peace, they will give it to you. There are two sisters that look alike, not really identical. One is plumpy, one is slim, and the one that is plumpy is the younger one. The one that is slim and smallish is the older one. And she seems to be she's said to be the one that is a little bit karma among the both of them. And they were like, We are coming to give you guys bass boost as either hot anyway guys i'm super pumped for this particular season and i cannot wait for it to start for it to kick off because they are having a custodian challenge by 9 p.m is that right right 9 p.m when i'm making this video and big brother has not said anything yet so i'll be coming back to tell you guys what the custodian challenge is about thank you so very much for watching the video did you watch it are you feeling any of the housemates what are your thoughts about the housemates leave all in the comment section i will see you guys in my next video subscribe like and leave your comments bye guys